loves it's your girl april so today's video is going to be another wig by order wigs online i did receive a wig from them last month and for this month they did send me some badass lashes along with that a wig cap and a bright yellow tooth wide tooth comb and of course a wig so this is a 22 inch lace front and she's gorgeous i know the color is popping it is a lace front so of course there are combs in the unit and of course the normal and adjustable strap in the nape so you guys before i even did this video i started this video i did pre-tweeze a part along with that i did kind of like pre-plug or pre-tweeze the hairline you know you want it to look natural as possible now my thing is this i'm not like one of the best at pre-tweezing hairlines or at least i wasn't i have balded and scalped a couple over the past few months but with this one i actually did a really good job and i'm saying three weeks after this i really did a good job like you know watching some videos on youtube always helps but i really wasn't feeling the part in this unit so that is the reason why i am like combing and just looking all in the mirror plus on top of that you know what i'm saying i just felt like it needed to be a little bit further over opposed to me spraying myself with water i did really want it to all go on the wig because you do need a little bit of water or some type of wet product to make a part lay so i also do like to use the rat tail combs and of course why would i be pressing this hot roller or hot curler in my head if it wasn't for a reason it's definitely to make your part lay and you will need some really good tweezers just to pre-pluck the hairline or the part in your unit now you guys if you want to make it look really like scalpage you like make it look really really more natural and realistic you're definitely going to have to need some makeup so i got my you know bougie estate lauder you know foundation stick right here and along with that you will need a makeup brush so this one i'm going to use is an angle makeup brush and it's really thin so i don't want the foundation to get all over but i do want to put a little bit of pressed powder because i'm saying if you're gonna do a part, you definitely want to do one that looks more natural and close as possible to your scalp. So try to use your own foundation because I'm pretty sure that if it's yours, it's gonna definitely match your skin color. So for the hairline, like you see that, it looks really natural. I mean, I'm saying I did a really good job this time. Um, I mean, it took me a little bit of time, but hey, practice makes perfect. It's always best to take your time and hey, why not try for like a fifth time on a wig that was just not really expensive so i'm saying i was proud of myself so i'm going to use my pump it up hairspray just to lay my wig down yes ladies i'm using pump it up hairspray the super hold it does hold your wig down it's not gonna hold your wig down for like weeks but like for the day or maybe even for two days you'll definitely be able to wear it and it'll look like it's yours especially if your edges look like mine right now i mean like look at the hairline like i mean ladies look like seriously get yourself like a really good toothbrush this is the one that i'm always using in my videos this is like my favorite one i don't even know where i got it from but honeys did you girl do a good job or what like i pre-plucked and pre-tweezed this hairline so damn good like i'm tooting my own horn like i really cannot believe it hey now for this side listen don't judge me i did say practice makes perfect so this side is a little bit more dense as you guys can see so i'll definitely be going back to the drawing board with that one so we're just gonna act like it's still cute we're gonna spray some of that pump it up on it you know and it does dry pretty fast to pump it up but hey if you want to use a blow dryer you're definitely welcome to sometimes i do that depending on you know if i'm in a rush or not but for the most part that side doesn't look that bad but it damn sure doesn't look as good as this side like i'm impressed i mean i'm saying like this side doesn't look that bad i mean come on ladies like really look at this like does that look like it's growing out of my scalp like the edges are like bomb and even this side looks good like you know i might have like a really thick hairline you never know but for the most part the hair is actually really pretty um i did wash it before this video because you definitely want to wash your curly hair before you wear it because the the transformation is totally different it just takes on a totally different look and this wig is actually really really full and especially when you just put the hair behind your ears with like the perfect hairline like listen look hey april i mean go april i'm really really excited about this hairline so like excuse me for a second i just was you know cheering myself on so since the hairline is so bomb on that particular side i'm gonna go ahead and twist it up in one of my little twisty do's um and just show off the edges to the world like let everybody see how fleek they are so let me grab myself a clip you know so that way you guys can all see how done up my edges are like look at that 
Like, look, I'm saying, does that look natural? What? Like, so cute. So the color, I know you guys are like, what color is that on the fleek edges? It's a color number six, which is called Chestnut Brown on the website. And they do have some really nice wigs. Like, this website, you don't have to wait 30 to 40 days to get, like, some good edges. I mean, excuse me, not some good edges, like, some really good, nice hair color. Like, what I mean by that is you can just go ahead and order whatever colors they have because they have loads of different colors on the website that are already in stock and you don't have to wait, like, 30 to 40 days. So, in case you guys are like, what are you doing here? So, I'm not that great with doing ponytails, especially in thicker hair. So, I decided to do me, like, a little twist up, kind of like ponytail thing because, you know, it's super hot out here and, you know, in AZ. And, yes, you guys, I know, like, the back does need to be a little bit pulled down but for the sake of the video i'm just showing you guys how cute you guys can look with like a little twisted up ponytail the got to be um, excuse me not the got to be but the pump it up hairspray does really work and definitely check them out i love um order wigs online they have some really nice units and like i said if you're looking for a variety of color then you can definitely check their website out because they're always in stock so all the information is down below i love you guys stay diva and divalicious thanks for subscribing and watching and i'll see you guys in a soon to come video bye